gaze upon the golden spoils of our latest plunder, I'll cut ye down for that. Ahoy, come! These ghostly tails be billowing as we set course. 
yours for a curse and thunder. No, me hearty. Who will be joining me on this haunted voyage? Okay, guys. So here he is. Home Depot 2024 Pirate Sidekick, aka the first mate. I am super pleased with this guy. Um, the detail is really good. Like if you look at his teeth, uh, the skeleton's like all like discolored a little bit. The hands are really good. I don't know what. There's a little bit of like junk there, but the hands look really good. They go all the way down to the forearm almost. This one looks really good. The treasure chest looks awesome. Um, some of the beads are kind of loose here, but that's not really a super bad thing. The treasure chest is just so detailed. I love it. It's really, really good. He's got his own belt. He's got the uh, the eye patch, of course, and the um, bandana, which looks great. The shirt looks really good. This is all just like printed on there, but it looks really good. It looks like mold. Um, I'm a big fan. He's also got his peg leg, which looks awesome, and a really detailed boot. It's even got like the laces and stuff. Like we haven't seen anything like that since like the older Jemmy days, man. Like that's really nice. That, that's real leather right there. I think it feels real. No, it's not. I don't know. Um, it feels real. Um, the pants look good. I really like the bottle. I've seen like a lot of people like complaining on how detailed the bottle is, but I feel like that's kind of a pro in my opinion if he's a dead pirate skeleton and he's been drinking out of this bottle for like a hundred years like there's not gonna it's gonna look like it's covered in dirt you know what i mean um mine is actually really nice the mouth doesn't like clack at all like i've seen a lot of them doing uh one kind of con and this isn't like a big deal is the neck is latex and i'm not really sure why because it's not like a classic servo head where it like slides in and you tie like the nut or the bolt on it's just a square tube and then all the servo mechanics are inside um so i'm not sure why they did that they could have just made it like plastic and then you don't have to worry about it rotting but it looks really good so i'll give it that um i really wouldn't change a thing about this guy the phrases are awesome i love the one where he mentions like the sirens and it has like them singing it's really really cool um, I'm not sure if I prefer that he does have an eyeball I kind of want to see what it looks like without but I don't think it can pop out easy because of the way his head is and the eyeball looks really good but I kind of wonder if it would look better without but I'm not sure um, yeah super good pirate prop I'm doing a big pirate theme this year so I kind of had to pick him up um, so yeah Big fan of this guy, wouldn't change a dang thing. He's great. If you're doing anything pirate related or are interested in pirates at all, I highly recommend him because we just don't get pirates like ever. Like I think the last one we got was like that Jemmy one from Lowe's, which was pretty dang cool. A lot of people don't even know about that one. But uh, that was like 2012, I think. So it's been a long time. So if you're interested in pirates, you gotta get him. Um, Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. This guy is definitely a must-buy for your pirate fan. Only $150. It's a steal. Uh, see you guys later.